Hey guys, it's Ravenhawk6910 recording once again with a new layout update video for you guys. It's just the start of January of 2024, so welcome to the new year. So I've finally been able to start back on scenery work on the layout on this other side, which I'll show you in just a minute. I also got a new O-Gage item that came in that I want to show you guys, so let's not waste any more time and jump right into it. So first off, I got this Lionel Station Sounds Dome car that just came in recently. And it's really cool. Uh, it's one of the new 21-inch cars, and what's cool is that this is one of the ones that ran with NW 611 a few years ago. So the station sound sequences on it are actually for a steam excursion. It actually says when you push the announce sequence, the steam excursion is now arriving or departing. And th these Lionel cars don't come with any figures on the inside. So I had to add figures myself. So let me just open up the dome here and I'll show you what I did. These cars are very easy to add figures to. You just pop the top of the dome off and there you go. And you can also undo four screws on the underside to put more figures in there if you want to. But yeah, this car was really easy to add the figures to and I had a whole bunch left over from a couple of Pullman heavyweights that were completely trashed. So I took the figures out of those and added them to this car, and they came out really good, as you can see. I'm really happy with the result here. So yeah, and I've ran this one time up at the museum at TVRM as well, so it's really cool to get this car out and on a layout. It's just really fun to throw a Station Sounds car of any kind, really, into an excursion consist. So, yeah. The scenic, the summit view, excuse me, I always want to call it the scenic view for some reason, but it is in fact the summit view. It is a really cool car, and yeah, I really enjoy it. I'm really glad I got it. It was expensive, but it was worth it. Moving on to the scenery work on the layout. This side of the layout is an absolute mess right now. I've got the track torn up and everything, but I just got this layer of ground cover laid down last night, and yeah. It's starting to look pretty good. It's not perfect. I do have some more areas to cover, but I ran out of ground cover, so I got to get some more. So I put some here, and I also put some over here where the Christmas trees are. Now that one I just used the Woodland Scenics Course Turf because I'm not a big fan of it anymore. And I just decided to use up what I had up in this corner, and it worked out well. And the rest of the stuff I'll use the fine turf on and I just spread my remaining paint out onto the table and I'll put another coat on it once I get the fine turf in again. I'm using this bare multi-surface roof paint which I've had for several years now and it's worked really well for covering layouts for me. So once I get some more ground cover and some scenic cement which is actually on the way I will bond all of this in place, including this area over here, which I haven't done yet. And I'll bond all this in place. And then I can start laying down some more once the time comes. But we are slowly getting some more scenery work done on the layout, and I'm really happy about that. One goal I want to try to do for this year is finish up all of the track work in the yard area and the turntable area. Because all these locomotives right here are just sitting on the ground. They're not actually on any f tracks. And that's including the ones that are in the stalls right now. So I want to try to finish up the track by the end of the year if I can. So let's see if I can do that. And just for a reminder, the turntable itself is not powered. It spins free-handedly. So that's okay. So this will just be more of a display area for the models. But either way... Let's see if I can make that happen by the end of the year. So there you go, guys. That's basically everything I wanted to show you. Just not a whole lot going on, but we do have some scenery work going on. That's really good. It was really fun adding figures to that dome car as well. So yeah, we're slowly getting things started up here again with the new year. So I will look forward to showing you guys more progress as it continues. So... But until then, I'll see you guys in the next video and down the road. This is Ravenhawk6910, signing off.